Hello, welcome back to Eccentric Social Vibrations. I am Blue Daisy Love 7. Hey, Sagittarius. What's up, existing subscribers? Hi. First time here, I welcome you here. Like, share, subscribe, come join the Eccentric Bunch. You know all the tarot stuff. I don't want to repeat it every time, but it may or may not resonate, okay? Let's just get on in here, okay? I'm your t tarot liaison for today. Okay, different strokes for different folks, all right? Things will come out as I go or wherever I go, okay? You could play sports or be into sports. Um, as a person, you could just have excellent sportsmanship, okay? Sportsmanship, okay? I feel like you take or you took one for the team, okay? You could be a star player for sure, okay? Stress relief. Uh, Maybe you're in a quarrelsome environment or have been in some type of quarrel with some people or someone, okay? You may have recently thought about deactivating or maybe taking down your social media page or considering doing that um there's some online disputes here uh, online beef okay beefing and bickering online or offline okay a hero ain't nothing but a sandwich that's an old 70s movie Cicely Tyson okay you could have tried to be a hero and come in and try to save the day or help the people okay and that may not have went well things may have actually went the opposite way somehow I feel like you're try you tried to ride in and help and be a hero saved the day and that backfired on you okay even if not online I feel it could be you somehow getting caught up you know just with the mess caught up in other people's messes mess drama some people's friends or family you know you know they gonna have to learn how to fight their own battles because to hell with all of that okay because why are we going back and forth, okay? Why are we beefing, bickering, and going at it? You know, going up against one another, hitting below the belt, you know? You know, I know the Alabama Riverfront just happened not too long ago, you know, and you got your folding chair out, okay? You could have been a part of that or a part of another separate brawl, okay? brawl, okay? But I feel like you joined in to help the people, okay? Stress relief is needed outside any of that, okay, honey? Okay, things could be a lot more civil or a lot more subtle, Okay, because this like riots or revolutions or something. Do you want a revolution? Who, who, where is Kirk when you need him? Okay, you know, that could be symbolic or important to you. But, you know, I feel like, you know, it just was like the opposite. It was the opposite, okay? The energy is kind of over, but still, also I'm getting a civil suit. Um, You may have really had something really embarrassing happen to you also i'm getting punitive damages for someone there's some pain some sadness you know you have to fight to stand up to get that okay but i feel like if i if you do i feel feel like you will win because it's clear evidence in your case okay but i feel like you already know that don't you i'm your confirmer for today okay because i feel like they ganged up on y'all or you Okay, three or four against one or two persons, you know, starting a riot. Stop it. Okay, I feel like you need to stay hydrated or drink more water. Okay, this could have happened less than 10 days or 10 months ago, any of the things mentioned. Still somewhat recent to me. If you, it feels still somewhat recent to me. Okay, if none of that is you. I feel like you are at a place where you are just cutting out anything or anyone that comes with drama, um, combative people, the people that have, you know, caused you pain and sadness, caused, you know, any suffering. Ones that may have been exposed is shown up to you in your life as fakes and frauds. Okay, getting rid of it or them, you know, letting folks know that you're not up for any of the BS and the mess anymore. Okay. Mary J. Blige, heavy on the no more drama. I feel like no one's ever going to make me hurt again. You know, that's you. You know, 
also, you know, dumping folks, you know, pouring out that energy, you know, healing, you know, focusing on your healing. I feel like you're not playing, you know, if it's not serving the queen, then they are out. OK, you're putting them out or the energy, you know, it needs to go out. OK, someone needs to be very careful going out at night because people are totally unhinged out here. OK, horses, the Trojan era, any of that. Uh, I think that's any B c era could be significant um or symbolic to you been her okay i feel like um you may not like horses okay you might not even like horses um you may not like riding animals or maybe you think riding um animals is just not good it's just a dislike to you but animal sports comes up you know um so the derby, like the Kentucky Derby or any derby or horse racing, okay? Uh, the ladies look fabulous. That's a rich man's sport. Ladies, go to the derby. Put you a fancy hat and a dress one, okay? Also, if you are, if that is important to you or you are a guy that d that does uh betting on the horses or whatever, uh, don't bet on the white horse, okay? Something could happen to the horse, an injury or something, all right? And maybe you just a thoroughbred. That's slang for the real, the truth, cornbread, Fred country, okay? Man or woman, you know, the real thing, you know? Male or female, both masculine and female are showing up. Some man is going to lose to a female in a battle of some kind, just to let you know. Apply it as you see fit, you know, but don't be deceived by a certain woman. She may try to get you in some way, okay? She may be dumping you, uh, so breaking up with you, vice versa. You could be about to quit her, as my grandma used to say, quitting folks. You know, quitting the relationship, you know, about to break up or leave her. You're done fighting for her or done letting that heifer run the show. OK, um, and Aquarius, it doesn't have to be outside of that. Don't let anything. Um, well, you are not letting anything stop your healing or stop your shine anymore. OK, not anymore. I feel like y'all, you know, y'all see that clip that's going around. I think it's fake, but, you know, it's funny. You know, one more time and you're through. I don't need none of it. You know, that's you. I feel like it's time for you to finally be the star of your own show, Aquarius, okay? Um, could be your rising sign or in your chart or somebody, you know, in the situation, um, but I feel like you have a new outlook on things. You're separating yourself from people. Okay. A new revolution. Okay. <laughs> changes, major changes of you. Okay. You are taking action, you know, trying to recover after loss. Also the name hope can be symbolic or important to you. It could be your name or you know her name or even this could be a spirit guide name hope h-o-p-e someone that has transitioned over you know named hope uh it's a she um even if that's not the name also birds this person shows up in the form of birds red bird yellow uh, or maybe even white birds any of those could be symbolic to you Sagittarius, you know, but I feel like they are actually good omens for you. The North Star could be representative uh, of something to you or could be representative. Uh, could, I'm sorry, I'm stuttering. Uh, could represent something or be special to you. Okay. The Queen. Okay. People, you know, I feel like also people are going to be mad. You know why? I feel like people going to be mad because you're going to be shitting on them. <laughs> <laughs> okay with the queen of swords you know mad because you beat them you know and you will win okay you're the you're a star player okay you are the star okay you know you make the team okay the queen the man you know deactivate your social media if you need a break or time to heal and focus on other stuff you know letting go of all of that you know, that was mentioned, all of the negative stuff that was mentioned would be much, much, much better for you. Okay. 
Good luck to you, Sagittarius. Take care. Like, share, subscribe. Come join the Eccentric Bunch. I appreciate you. Good luck in everything.